It's race day here in Melbourne as we continue with what could shape up to be one of the best Australian Grand Prix. Here we are then at the Albert Park circuit. 3.3 miles of bumpy street track, but not a lot in the way of elevation changes. The circuit goes all the way around the lake, taking in 16 corners. Note the DRS zones into turns 1, 3 and 13. They'll offer our drivers a number of good opportunities to overtake. Anthony Davidson joins me once again in the commentary box. And it's fantastic to have you with us here today. But I'm curious, as a man with experience out on the track, how do you stop those pre-race nerves from becoming overwhelming when you're lining up on the grid? Well, from the moment qualifying's over, you start to feel the adrenaline in your body build up and the buzz in your stomach as you anticipate the rundown into Turn 1. It's all a bit like going into battle, and the unknown situation makes you nervous. Those pre-race nerves are a good thing. The day you don't have them means that you don't care anymore. And of course, you have to make sure that all the procedures are second nature to you so that they're not taking up too much of your capacity. With the race minutes away from starting, here's what today's grid rundown looks like. Young superstar Max Verstappen starts from pole position. Sergio Perez lines up alongside. As we continue through the rest of the grid today, we have Bottas, Hamilton, Daniel Ricciardo, the Tiger, Leclerc, Joe, Gasly and George Russell, Vettel, Norris, Yuki Tsunoda and Ocon. Mazepin, Sainz, Antonio Giovinazzi, and Mick Schumacher, Latifi, Giotto, Eilert, and Lance Stroll brings the grid to a close. It's almost time for the lights to go out, so let's head down to the track and get this Grand Prix underway. Racing again, the safety car is in this lap. When the field accelerates, remember, there is no overtaking until the green flags. Safety car in this lap.
please stay clear of the white line on the exit. You'll receive a penalty for dangerous driving if you cross over into the track. Green flag. out of the back. Last place. Pilot is ahead of you. They're on old softs. Look after these tyres now. We want to finish the race on this compound. Nine laps to go. Nick is coming in for his stop. job. Verstappen is ahead of you. Gap to car in front is 3.1 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. seconds.
Okay, good job, mate. Really well done. That was a fantastic drive. Not just victory today then, but the championship as well. What a spectacular season they've had. Congratulations to the whole team. Anthony Davidson, how do you think they were able to set themselves apart today? It was a question of right place, right time today. We were looking at an entirely different race before the safety car came out, but they were able to take full advantage after the field had been bunched up. Red Bull put up an outstanding fight for the front position today, and it's great to see it paid off for them. They do so much for the sport that you can't help but be delighted by today's race win. Despite the best efforts of our championship leader, that lead has taken a bit of a knock today. After an incredible day of racing, who was your driver of the day, Ant? I have to give it to the Tiger. Look at where they finished compared to where they started. It's not easy to cut through the field like that in Formula 1, so it was a great effort. And it's another title in the bag for Red Bull. After a long and hard-fought season, they've built an astonishing car this year, and the glory they'll be taking back to Milton Keynes is fully deserved. It's been an absolutely wild weekend of Formula One action. I can't wait to see what's next. The fans really seem to enjoy that. You made it look easy. How do you feel these grid penalties are affecting this? We all underestimated you, didn't we? It wasn't your rival's day today, was it? You left some bodywork out there on the track. Were you struggling for grip? Appreciate your time. Our running costs are significantly less than the income we're pulling in. I suggest we start looking for opportunities to spend that profit margin.